My name is Jennifer Morris. I am a cloud infrastructure engineer with 10th Magnitude. I'm Amanda Kabak, a managing consultant here at 10th Magnitude. I'm Shannon Keen. I'm a cloud infrastructure engineer. Hi, I'm Annie Hedgepeth, and I'm a cloud automation engineer at 10th Magnitude. When I was young, I always liked to play with Legos and Connect sets. I wanted to kind of be an engineer of sorts. Um, so as I grew up, I kind of got also interested in, in computers. And so that's where my interest in infrastructure came from. I've been doing software engineering a long time now, but there's great satisfaction in solving problems. The female that has been the most inspiring to me is a woman named Linda Rising. She gives a talk on the agile mindset and how it's more beneficial for us to have an agile mindset, believing that we can learn whatever we want to learn, as opposed to a fixed mindset, which says that you're either smart or not smart, or you can learn or you can't learn, or you're technical or not technical. I can choose to believe that I can learn whatever I want to learn, and so I don't have to hold on to those old beliefs of the past that I'm not a technical person or not a math person or whatever, because I am limiting myself when I believe that. If I'd have to say my mom really was a great mentor. She was able to show us how to speak up, how to give ourselves a voice, and how to be a driven female in the world that we live in. It's not exactly an easy feat. lucky in that I haven't seen a lot of resistance to forward progress in my career like other women I've known, but my advice to anyone starting out in any technical field is this. Be humble, but be intrepid. Ask questions, speak up, educate yourself, and trust in your mind. If you're interested in engineering, keep at it. Don't let anybody get in your way. Don't let anybody tell you no. Stay organized, work hard, and stay focused and eventually you, you will end up where you want to be. You are the decider of your own fate. Don't let somebody else decide it for you. So my advice to budding engineers would be to feel the fear and do it anyway, and don't limit yourself, and be the person that you want to be.